And there's her canopy right there. Yep, wouldn't secure it. The final setup, we actually filled this up with snacks. Snacks, waters, waters, ham, tomatoes. Uh, freezer works good. Microwave wasn't even used. Sink. Uh, there's a mess in here because there's a plan for that. Nothing in there. Level. TV. Trucks. It's a little messy. We we'll watch TV there. Or fan for extra fanaroo. AC works great. Right now it's off because it cycles, which is great. Blanket because it gets super cold in here. Storage window, which we haven't really used. Other door, there it goes. It's on. Gotta remove my phone because it's gonna get frozen. Nice little bed. Big old bed. So that's comfortable. Another window. Oh, neighbors. So we got. Armini Beast and then you got Big Beast Nice little campground or canopy once again Restrooms Kayaks boat ramps Pier Nice water and Badass dinner so we're back, we're back from our what, two day getaway. And this is just uh, what we experienced for those two days. We didn't use the window and we didn't use the vent. Uh, we, we did have a 30 amp hookup. So we went ahead and used that bad boy right there. And that right there. It still works with a battery. Works good. I think my buddy got it at Walmart. He let me have it. Um, wife chose that side. And I got this side right here. So I'm 5'9", 5'8", 5'9", approximately. And uh, one thing I can say is that little table, yes, it goes up and down. Um, it interferes with your turning a little bit but not not bad to get used to um that fire extinguisher bothered my wife when she would toss and turn she would kind of hit it so we might just raise it up just a tad bit but other than that like i said i'm five eight five nine and i fit real good in here like i said my feet stay under the table but when i turn i'll hit it or if i bring it down i kind of tap it this is a front portion. I make this temporary, I guess you can say, um, deterrent. It's not really a lock. It's a lock, but I mean, anybody wanting to get into it is going to get into it. So for me, it's a deterrent. Uh, I still need to work on it. I'm still going to do some more stuff to make it a little harder. Propane, we didn't even use it. We didn't even, probably going to take it out. Either build a box or buy a box. Put a battery, put the battery in there, and probably bring our our cords and stuff them in there. The chucks. Other than that, propane out. One another thing we enjoyed was the galley door that raises up, so it acts it acts as a, as a canopy or shade area. It's a little spice rack. 
microwave we used it one time for some coffee door you get that little string and the door, uh, TV pops out you can swivel it <coughs> sink awesome worked great olive oil for spices I put it down there because up here it hops off with uh, with the bumps um, you have your battery and fresh water tank meter there so right now obviously we're full because uh, we just drove it down and it got charged uh, in the first tank we're running at around one-thirds of water in there uh, you have an outlet there I believe that's a 12 volt I don't know what's in there and then you got a USB a little port there we've just charged our phone off of that so I don't know what else it works with um, little Dometic fridge had a few waters in here we had uh, veggies in here we had more waters in here we had ham we had uh, burger patties up here for a while it's still wet in there it's we just got back uh, so that worked out great little fridge worked out great this became a storage for snacks cups ziplocs foil paper coffee these these compartments right here became storage for napkins, cups, creamers. I don't know if I showed this one yet, but we have the level that that plug is that we want to connect to the house, and a few utensils and a remote for the TV. Really recommend if you for any any unit, any whether it's this unit, uh, whatever unit, <clears throat> connect and you have a TV, you get this. Uh, connector and you can watch stuff from your phone onto the TV so that came in handy uh, other than that in here it's messy because it's still in the works I have pieces of wood because I am gonna be working on a little project wife came up with an idea so we're gonna be doing that in the near future I, I already have it cut out I just need to assemble it screw it in and stuff but other than that the trailer worked great. Went smooth down the road. Towed it with that bad boy right there. And did great. Did really good. We're already planning our next trip within the next month or so. So hopefully everything comes out turns out great and God willing we can go out on another trip. Test it out again. <laughs>